Your words are meaningless here. Your blood will pay the debt our king demands. Your sacrifice will lift his curse from our land. General Balatun! Forgive me, my lord. The king demands your urgent presence. The gods smile on you. For now. Take this one back to his cell. I'll deal with him later. You're in luck, Gutian. Luck? No. No luck for these dogs. General, you should leave this place. The king, his madness threatens to swallow us all. This temple is cursed. I'd rather die in this cursed house than perish to the plague and famine out there. We have our orders, Captain. I see everything. Look around you. Is this what not famous enough for my mistake? Do the gods not bask in its glory? The Gutians are coming, General. The moon god sends an army to destroy us. I shall muster our forces immediately. Good. And what news from below? There are hundreds of prisoners, my king. Their sacrifice will take time. Time is no longer in our hands. No matter. The blood of this army will nourish the sands. The sacrifice will be fulfilled. Starting with this one. Tell me, General. Does she remind you of anyone? My king? Do you not see a hint of your own daughter in her? What age would she have been now? Eighteen. Eighteen? Hmm. What a tragedy this plague has been. Kill her. By your command. <laughs>
Let's give me strength. died for our king. Their sacrifice bought him nothing.
Help me with this. that adorns you. Nothing to concern an Arcadian. How do we get out of here alive? The enemy of my enemy is a friend. We help each other. There is always hope. together. No! If we both run, then we both die. Ready your sword!
you teeter on the edge of an abyss. Your survival depends on the choices you make. They will be as a compass guiding you through the unknown. Will you find the path to salvation or be lost in the darkness? Let me speak plainly. You are about to make some difficult decisions. Decisions that will affect the lives of others. How those decisions play out will become clear over time. I expect you're wondering who I am and where you are. I am the curator, the custodian of tales. My purpose is to keep a record of everything you do, every decision or mistake you make. This is my repository. It's filled with untold stories. Stories about friends and enemies. Loyalty and betrayal. Life. And death. Understand that I am not here to help you. Although, I have been known to bend the rules time to time. To descend into the unknown alone is extremely brave. Or extremely foolish. Perhaps there is more to you than meets the eye. Let me give you a few words of advice. Throughout the story you will encounter certain pictures Pictures which allude to possible outcomes. I suggest you pay attention to their meaning. It could foreshadow a future best avoided. But alas, the sands of time have run out. We'll meet again soon to see how you fare. Or fail. early, Lieutenant. Things are moving fast. I hear you, Colonel. Glad to have you on board. Techs are ready for your presentation. As soon as we get word from the CEO, we're good to go. You should read this. Can you hear? There's a new king in the castle. Looks that way. You are? My assistant, Clarice Stokes. Dr. Clarice Stokes. Kolchak. First Lieutenant. Kolchak. Well, the briefing room? Time together, Rachel. After what happened at the checkpoint, I thought I was done. These last few weeks, you've, you've lifted me up. I don't know where I'd be without you. Rachel King. I'll be there in five. Fuck, it's him. 
this early. Your husband, you mean? Don't you think it's about time you came clean? Put your clothes back on. Straighten up. All right, Rachel. Are you going to tell him about us or what? You and Eric have been apart for a year. Whatever you had, it, it's got to be over. Maybe I just don't think this is the right time. That's bullshit. There's never a right time. Soon, Nick. I promise. Soon. I'll see you at the briefing. Shit. Disorder. Just getting the base set up. Hmm. Blows my mind. Only a few weeks ago, Saddam was living it up in here. <laughs> Down down in Candy Bar and lost up four bastards with his toenail. Nice image. Uh, if only you could see the state of this place now. It makes me smile. <laughs> We got the CIA, we got the Army, the Marines, the CIA, the Air Force. Hey, everyone's invited. Everyone wants a piece of history. God bless America. I see you, old man. I'm busting out those reps. Hey, you come join me. Maybe I'll teach you a thing or two. Later, we have company. Yeah. This here would like to watch me get my sweat. You gonna spot me, little lady? I'll see you just fine from here, thanks. Ignore Corporal Merwin, he likes social media. Yeah, I guess every unit has its resident jackass. Target K. This is Lieutenant Colonel Kane. Just taking him down to the briefing room. Yeah, gotta go get prepped. I'll see you in there, Marine. So what's his malfunction? Nick ain't been himself lately. We got caught up in a shooting a few weeks back. Civilian ate a bullet. Nick took it hard. Is he combat ready? He's a big boy, sir. He's ready. Damn, Joey, they got you sitting behind a desk? You want me to make a call? Nah, I'm all good. People who sit behind desks don't tend to catch so many bullets, you know? So this must be uh, the one and only satellite guy. <laughs> the one and only satellite guy. I'm Eric King. Lieutenant Colonel Eric King. Give the Colonel full sight access. I'm telling you, if the queen bitch finds out about this, she's gonna flip her shit. That's my wife you're talking about. I had no idea, I'm sorry. Nice work, hot shot. So sorry. Rachel never said she was married. We've been working apart this last year. So she's the queen bitch now. She's gone up in the world. If it helps, we like to think of it as a term of endearment. Shut up. I hope the bandwidth can cope with the data. I'll leave the techie stuff to you. And I'll leave the heavy lifting to you. We got a deal, lady. What is this place, anyway? 
That's exactly what it is. I guess you damn like to get down on the dance floor. I think if his dance partner stepped on his foot, it'd be an instant off with her head. <laughs> well, it wouldn't surprise me. Maybe when we're done, I'll let you spin me around. As long as you don't step on my foot. Mrs. King. Eric, this is my team. And if you want to brief them, you clear it with me first. I should have warned you I was moving the briefing forward. That's on me. But things escalated, I had to move fast. I have a duty to my team to stay ahead of the curve. I understand, Rachel, but CENTCOM has given their orders. Orders? I'm now commanding officer. I didn't mean for you to find out like this. Truly. I'm sorry, Rach. Somehow I doubt that very much. This is from Sock Central. It confirms that Lieutenant Colonel King has assumed control of this operation. I'm gonna need access to your network. I'll patch you through. Name? Dr. Stokes. You can call me Clarice. Dr. Stokes, please prepare the presentation. You found something? What the fuck is that? Modern art or something? This is footage from the highly classified Kalis program. That's supposed to mean something to me. It's a thermal satellite system that I personally pioneered. Oh, well, I'm impressed. Please, pioneer away. You behave like this in all your briefings, Corporal? Boys are just eager to catch a break, sir. No harm, man. Very well. Satellite sweeps of the war zone have uncovered what appears to be an underground storage facility. This will, of course, require further investigation, but I strongly suspect where Saddam's chemical weapons are hidden. We got you, you son of a bitch. CENTCOM has given the green light to raid the facility and seize any weapons on site. Hostilities may be over, but there are holdout groups of Republican Guard all over the country. They could deploy those weapons at any time, so we need to move fast. The Army is giving us a ride out there on their helos. On arrival, Lieutenant Kolchak will lead the raid on the facility. Once it's secured, we'll carry out a full weapons inspection. Now listen up. There's been a change of leadership, but Rachel's operational expertise and local knowledge is just as valuable as ever. She'll be flying with us, and I want you all to show her the same respect. Any questions? What the fuck are we waiting for? I'm ready. That's tribal territory out there, Colonel. Make no mistake. Those people are feral. I take it we're getting their support? Nah. Too many birds could bring them down on us. Move fast in, fast out. Yeah, that's pretty much what your mama said to me. Hey, careful, boy. If I didn't pull out so fast, could have been your papi. All right, that's enough, Merwin. Sir, what's your call? I'll put in a request for air support to be on standby. Our birds can fly low under the radar. The site is in the Zagros Mountains, so we'll have plenty of ground cover. We go dark until weapons are secured. If we don't break radio sounds within 24 hours, CENTCOM will mount a rescue operation. A lot of shit can go down in 24 hours. I'll quit being a bitch. I'm just saying, that's all. This is why we went to war. This is what gets us out of bed every morning. Make no mistake, ladies and gentlemen, this is how we stop Saddam from using these weapons. Be ready in one hour. Dismissed. Clarice, help me stop the equipment. I'm on it. I don't know, man. This don't feel right. 
I'm getting this tingle down the back of my neck. Oh, sweetie. Look, good rub down will sort that right out, huh? I'm serious. I got a real bad feeling about this. That's what you get from spending too much time with Eric. Is there anything you can do? I'm gonna download the latest satellite data. You can have some alone time with him. Thank you, Clarice. Eric, we need to talk. There's something I have to tell you. You should know. It wasn't my decision to take over your operation. It's been a long time since we last saw each other. Eric. Please, let me finish. Not a day went by when you weren't on my mind, when I didn't want you by my side. I've missed you so much, Rach. This isn't about us, Eric. I just want things to go back to the way they were. How we left it, things weren't so great between us. We've been through worse. A lot worse. <sighs> Nothing has changed, Eric. You know that. You and I, there is no you and I. It's over. Please, Rach. Don't say that. You're not wearing your wedding ring. Hey, be careful with that. Oh, shit, sorry. But you got in that box of tricks anyway. What the fuck is that? Ultraviolet light. We use it to sweep for explosives. Let me have a go. No. How much longer for that download, Clarice? I need it ASAP. It's five minutes ASAP enough for you? Downloading data now. Good. I'll check the satellite maps. Not the greatest bandwidth. We work with what we have. Can you sign this 1348? Huh? Equipment release form. Can you? Oh, sure. Check all equipment, then check it again. Yeah, I hear you. What the hell do we need this crap for? We need to be mobile. We need to be prepared. The facility is underground, possibly under construction. It's safer this way. Now you want me to feel safe? Give me some more shooters. So, you're my technician. I've heard about you. I should fucking hope so. I'm here to keep our gear in check. And if any Iraqis pop their heads up, I'll take them clean fucking off. You seem pretty confident, Corporal. If you need any assistance with the climbing gear, I'm here to help. Sure, I'll manage, Colonel. Climbing gear. Fucking pencil pusher. I think we'll bag Chemical Ali at this facility? If he's in the vicinity, we'll get him. <laughs> that almost makes it worth the risk. Almost. Well, you know, I'd still rather be sitting behind a desk. If shit hits the fan, at least we can rely on air support to dig us out. I'm sure it won't come down to that. You seem confident. You seem surprised.
That's what I think it is. WP, sir. White phosphorus? It's just for popping smoke. That's all. These are only to be used for cover. Understood? Understood. After all, Saddam is the one who's breaking weapons conventions. Not us. Downloads complete. Let's get to the helos. What? What? You want to ask me something? I can tell by that look on your face. What do you think of? I take it you're talking about the skipper? He's a nice guy. Around here, nice don't cut it. What do you think of him? Like he's got something else on his mind? Then, and again. Then. Then. Seeing Tanny. Yeah, but uh, hello, Anna Salim. 
Salim Garkun. Abu Zain. I forgot. He was Zain with... With... He was Zain with Abnik. Yes, Tariq. They were with each other. لا لا كله تمام اصل كان عيد ميلاده وانا جبت له هديه اه لما يرجع ابعته لي حالا اي وقت ابعته لي لو سمحت انت بتقول ايه سعادتك؟ العدو جاي يا سليم. العدو جاي علينا دلوقتي. العدو؟ يا فندم الحرب خلصت خلاص وخسرنا. معنى كلام فارغ، ما حدش السلم. العدو جاي ودي ارضنا واحنا لازم نتعرب ليها. شوف شايفينهم؟ مطلوب تأكيد. يلا. شوف جايين علينا. بقول لك احنا محتاجين كل راجل في مكانه لاحسن طايرتهم توصل عندنا. تمام يا فندم. حرق قلبي دور عجيبة. خلاص يا دور. دي آخر مهمة. sent here to do, and may God be my witness, we're gonna succeed. Amen to that, brother. Hoorah! Hoorah! Hoorah!
Captain. American go! Sir, we've been made! Awaiting orders! Ben out and hold fire. We're gonna sigh out this shit. Yellow smoke at the LT and bring in the Colonel. This rig's a bust. These people are not the enemy, they're just shepherds. Lieutenant Kolchak, set rep if you will. No shots fired, sir. No casualties. Farm is secure and we're processing captives. Captives? Have you located an entrance to the underground silo? Negative, sir. If there is one, it's well camouflaged. If there is one. What does that mean, Lieutenant? Colonel, I don't think these men are hostile. I'm starting to think they're just shepherds. Are you sure? Could it be a cover? You may be right. These are civilians. Lieutenant Kolchak made the right call to not go in guns blazing. That went smoothly. You think? We've got the place locked down tighter than the birds. Do not finish that sentence, Corporal. Are they ready for questioning? Yeah, just don't ask them any tough physics questions. Let's go. Stay sharp. If anyone so much as raises an eyebrow, I want to know about it. Copy that. I don't know about you guys, but something doesn't feel right about this place. Oh, yeah? So is that this, uh, women's intuition I keep hearing about? Yeah, you want to find out what happens when you piss it off? Stay still. I'm just gonna pat you down. Assalamu alaikum, ya akhi. Lazim asal sual, wa lazim tuqul al haqiqa. ثين مدخل مخزن السلاح I'll make him talk Stand by I've got this هسألك مرة ثانية فين مكان المخزن Is that? Some kind of effigy. Possibly pagan. Ada! 
حتى اعرفه قريب You heard him, Marine. Tell me where the silo is. This man was armed, ma'am. Everyone in this country is armed. The Bundoya to be a area up. After a minute, I'm going to فين مدخل المخزن؟ Stand down, Lieutenant. The only language these people understand. I've got this under control. Are there any more captives? Yeah, in the other hut. Follow me. أنا رجع حاليا، وبعدين. Keep a firm eye on this one. You got something to say, Sergeant? Look at the ground. What do you see? Jack shit. There was a silo, where's all the trunks? Nah. Man, this is a fishing expedition. This precious Kalis has got it all wrong. We follow orders, Sergeant. The search is far from over. Aye, sir. Heroin. It just keeps getting better by the minute. These people are nothing but common crooks. What the fuck was Eric thinking? I want this place turned inside out.
Someone give me a sit rep on the contact. Over. anymore.
fuck is this place? Get back topside, regroup with the rest of the squad, and signal for medivac. This place ain't no weapon silo, but it's sure as fuck crawling with Iraqis. Nick? Sergeant K, pull yourself together. Eyes wide. All good. Just wasn't expecting to suddenly fall into the fucking earth. I hear you. You ever seen anything like this? What the hell is this place? Guys, plumbed history at school. Give me a hand. I'm gonna need some more muscle. I'm skipping Jim again. Let's <laughs> move. Jesus, I'm mm. trying. Will you stop squirming around? He's fast. He's sleeping out. We have to cut him down right now. Hold tight, buddy. We got you. Nick, I need you here. Cut the wires. Tell you to keep your shit together. They're coming for us. 
أنا ملازم سليم عثمان بكل جنود أنتوا فين؟ حول كابتن دار أنت تسمعني؟ عندي رسالة حول كابتن زفت بحاول اخرج بحاول اخس يمكن آه. عندي مشاريع النهارده استحم اسمع موسيقى احتفل عيد ميلاد ابني بس لا دوب على باب انا لا لا كان جايين لا كان جايين بص احنا فين دلوقتي هم ما انا عارف انا فين في حد موجود هنا مين هناك؟
Are you okay? Are you hurt? I'm good. Did you see Sergeant K? Call check? Last I saw, they were together. They tried. Something's interfering with the signal. Might could be another way out. I don't know. You know I've got your back, Rage. Stay close, you'll be fine. I'm pretty good at looking after myself, Eric. It would seem so. <clears throat> Carabiners, quick draws, rope, light. Shit. Okay. All good? All good. Let's do it. Last the steep drop to nowhere. We've got rope. Hey, look, there's an airflow. I say we climb. So when did you start smoking? Excuse me? The lighter. Uh, it's nothing. Just something I picked up back at base. Are you ready? Are you? This place doesn't look much like a weapon silo to me. If there's nothing down here, then why were we attacked? There's a war on. People tend to shoot each other. I guess we could classify this as quality time. You and I always did have a different view on quality time. Remind you of old times, Rage? You mean the sense of feeling lost? seems stable. Yeah, it looks fine. this place is hard to say these carvings look religious i think we may be in a temple it's pazuzu pazuzu who pazuzu do you not watch horror movies you should know the answer to that it's a sumerian demon something to do with plagues i think Legs and demons, huh? Great. Unbelievable. I was not expecting this at all. Yeah, you and me both. Great, that's all we need. Think we can move it? Looks jammed pretty tight.
What is it? You didn't hear that? I didn't hear anything. I thought I heard something down there. Even in ruins, this place is still something special. I wonder what happened here. That's gunfire. Where's it coming from? We should move. Can you make anything out? It's, it's deep. That looks safe to you? It's our only option. Hit the rope. We're going down. Unbelievable. We're not the first ones here. Damn it. All this crap must be what Kayla's detected. I'm sorry, Eric. For real. You put everything into this research. More than you'll ever know. You can't blame yourself. I've messed up. Should have triple checked the data. Exhausted every possibility. But I was so sure this was it. I understand what it meant to you, Eric. I'm so sorry. There's no use in dwelling on it. We need to focus on the task ahead and find a way out of this place. What the hell is that? Subsidence? From the aftershocks? Looks like archaeological gear. Somebody was studying this ruin. Hey, we could use those lamps. The light could guide the Marines to us. Do you think that still works? It'll work. It just needs gas. We need to find some. this out. Why would there be a machine gun here? It's a World War II model. Ties in with the time the archaeologists were here. What the fuck happened here? All call signs, this is King. Does anyone copy? Over. We can get this thing started. This temple, it was built to appease the gods. take that thank you this is king to all call signs are you receiving over fuck that's a hell of a lot of fireworks
Eric, come give me a hand with these cans. Uh, tell me, I had a little luck. <sighs> How's the lake holding up? Lake? Oh, you mean the prosthesis? I lost my leg back on the highway. Don't. I still feel guilty. I didn't make it easy on you, Rage. I know that. You weren't to blame for that crash. Mom, let's get to work. Shine a light on the tank. Fuel tube's worn loose. The damn valve is leaking. Can it be fixed? We have to secure the tube before starting the generator. There's gotta be something here to fix it. You got it? I've got it. Once you said back at the base, you were wrong. Doesn't sound like me. You said nothing had changed between us. That changed. All that time spent away from each other. Couldn't stop thinking of you. Don't you feel the same way? Even a little? I missed you too, Eric. How could I not? You've been through so much. Hold the fuel pipe. It's done. Hey, give me a hand with this panel. the state of these they're shot feels like so long since we worked on something together same time feels like yesterday why do we leave things like this I tried you made it so hard for me to stay we should have stuck together I don't think either of us expected to be out of each other's lives for so long. The past year or so, my head's been buried in Kalis, and I was blind to anything else. Your work is bigger than the both of us. Like, I don't think either of us could have foreseen the impact it would have. Rach. Say what's on your mind. I've missed you, Rich. Like you wouldn't believe. Back then, I don't know, things seemed confused, but now, it just seems simpler. Maybe there's hope for us after all. That should do the trick. Let's fire her up.
don't make it. You're way safe. This way. Locals were spooked by these mountains. I can't say I blame them. Eric, take a look at this. You think it still works? Let's find out, shall we? The tape is all tangled up. It's fine, I can fix that. So when did you stop wearing your wedding ring? When did you stop wearing yours? I didn't. Always close to my heart. You're always a good guy. You need to go. I think you've forgotten what this ring means to me. I want you back, Rachel.
It was not supposed to play out like this. That's right, Troll. Okay, this is Mailman 2 on that show. Save him. Oh, Mailman 2 in actual, how copy over? Damn. Let me go. Slowing us down. We need to get to Rich. I can't leave me. I'll hold him off. Marlin, those are not Iraqi. Whatever the fuck they are, they're mine. Go. I'm not leaving a man behind. I'm fucking you. you go with me? Goddamn place. Look at that Sirius that looks decades old. That's all we have. Can you see him? Yeah, he's coming. souls fallen into. Poor Rachel has been lost to the darkness. Bonds that were once thought unbreakable have now been cut free. The heart is always the first to fall. And there are always unexpected casualties with any separation. What of Jason and Nick, brothers in arms, but are they really as close as they appear? Or will it be a case of each man for himself? Which brings us to Salim. He seems level-headed, an almost reluctant soldier, perhaps. An unwelcome fate now awaits our survivors, trapped beneath the earth, swallowed by the void.
one by one, their lights will be snuffed out. Unless you can find the means to save them. It's not my place to concern myself with the affairs of others, but it does keep things interesting. I can offer you some words of advice, as long as you are willing to keep this strictly between ourselves. A prudent choice, all things considered. Long ago, I met a blind poet who impressed upon me these wise words. Long is the way and hard, and out of hell leads the heart of the night. That's all for now. Stay tight. Colonel, is that you? What happened to Rachel? We, we were ambushed by the enemy. I think he's still here. They opened fire on us. And Rich. She fell. I, I held on. <laughs> as hard as I could, I swear. She was taking me down with her. I had to. I had to cut the rope. Rachel! They're coming for us. They're coming. We gotta move. Colonel, we're sitting ducks. We need to fall back. Now. Over there. Let's go. Oh. Look at that. Right now, Colonel, the Iraqis are the least of our problems. They're not following. This is mailman 21 actual to all call signs. How copy over? Joey, report in over. Joey's dead. The fuck you talking about? The Iraqis tore right through him. He died in my fucking arms. Oh, no, not Joy. The hell are we gonna get out of this? We gotta lock this place down. Form a defense perimeter and buy ourselves some goddamn breathing space. Lieutenant, what did you mean when you said the Iraqis are the least of our worries? You believe in God? Absolutely not. We'll start believing. We are under attack by... I don't know what. And you wouldn't believe me even if I tried. Hell, I don't believe in those there. Monsters. Monsters? Come on, you're jumping at shadow. Sir, with all due respect... Lieutenant! We're trapped down here with an enemy Iraqi, maybe more. Whatever you think you've seen, it's bullshit. These statues. Nick! Take a mental picture and snap the fuck out of it. What is this place? 
Clean up the silos, that's for sure. This mission's a bust. I can fix this. The satellite. Look over the data to improve the algorithm. They're clearly teething problems. Oh, fuck your satellite. Good men have died. Clarice is gone. Your wife is dead, Eric. You led us on a suicide mission. Hey, I'm still in command here. You'd better remember your rank, Lieutenant. I'll get us out of here. We should move on. Keep an eye on Merwin. We'll go check it out. This is Saddam's chemical weapon silo, huh? Run for the fucking hills. We're all doomed. So much for Eric's pioneering thermal satellite system. Eric's gonna have some pretty tough questions to answer. I wouldn't like to be in those shoes. There's the generator. Let's go take a look. Need a hand here. I'm on it. Someone sticking a serious dislike to this thing. Jeff Doug. Looks it. Watch my back. Oh, shit. Stop fucking around. Hurry up. Stay alert. Drop kick, this is mailman two one actual. We're heading deeper. Over. Cable split. Let's see where they lead to. This way. Fuck. Watch your step. There's a tripwire. Clear. It looks simple enough. Counter explosion? Nah. Just need to cut the trigger. Be the guy who shot at Eric. Motherfuckers hunting us. Dropkick, this is Mailman 21 Actual. Do you copy? Over. Your friend sprung an IED on us. We're good. You'll want to keep your eyes open in case he's left any more love notes. Over. He's moving up. Shame you warned him about the tripwire. October the 21st, 1946. Crow was the first to break into the tomb, an honor he shared with Bessie, that damned machine gun of his. It was a beast of a weapon, but it seemed to comfort the fellaheen doing the digging. This place has lain undisturbed for centuries. It is not the tomb of Alexander the Great, but a temple of an even older god king, the Akkadian despot, Naram Sin. We have been mistaken, but Lady Bradshaw still declares it a find for the ages. 
a discovery that will write our names in the annals of history. Looking out at this sceptered hall, I have no reason to doubt her. waiting for us down there. Shh. Listen. Is that Joey? Is she alive? It's not possible. You heard him just now. It can't be. That is definitely him. It's this fucking place, Jason. I'm telling you, I saw him die. All due respect, buddy. You're not your usual self. Can't know for sure. It's a trap. We don't know that. We don't leave men behind. Semper Fi. Semper Fi. Hey, somebody want to tell me what's going on here? We heard Joey through the tunnel. We think we heard Joey. It was him, all right. I'm gonna rescue him. Let me remind you that I make the decisions. I'll lead the way. Gold check. You guard Merwin. Sergeant K-9 will go ahead. Right you are, Colonel.
And I'm again. لازم يكون الشمس بس في حاجة ضايعة منه Still here, Joey? Corporal Gomez, this is Dropkick. Do you read me? You were with Lance Corporal Gomez, right? What actually happened to him? Die. Whatever's out there now, sure Shin and Joey. Well, in battle, these things are often difficult to judge. What's that supposed to mean? You could have been mistaken, Sergeant. If you say so, Colonel. We just have to hope he's still alive. We've lost enough today. I'm sorry, sir. How about Rachel? Is that so? Kolchak told me you people called her the Queen Bitch. Not by me. I knew her better than that. This fucking place. How deep is that damn hole? Saw pictures like this back at the temple. Best guess is the quakes open them up. Let's just keep going. Is that blood? Something really fucking nasty went down here. Seventh of December, 1946. Our finds have been so spectacular, I couldn't resist breaking out the champagne. 
As I entered the survey tent to pour a glass for Mary, I realized something was awry. She'd found Bradshaw's crate of dynamite. I tried to calm her, but she worked up a full head of steam, sounding off about the risks of using explosives at a dig site. She was right, of course. I feel terrible for hiding it from her. Just then, Crow arrived and picked up the dynamite. When Mary ordered him to put it down, he looked her boldly in the eye and said they'd found something below. What the hell did they find down there? Sounds close. Be quiet. We're walking into a trap. Dropkick. Colonel, are you there? Over. No.
I've seen ugly in my life, but never that ugly. What the fuck are we up against? Those things are everywhere. Never before have I ever seen anything so vicious. What do you think those things are? You know what? I, I don't know. I didn't think to ask. How about you? I don't know what they are. I, I shouldn't be here. I should be home with my son. I hear you. Family's everything. I should have never come here. It's his birthday today. Oh, man. You really shouldn't be here. How? Old enough to think he's a man. And he's only still a boy. He just turned 18. Oh, <laughs> big day. Big day. Let me tell you. Best present you can give him is to make sure you get home today. The only thing keeping me going. Well, if we're in hell, I guess you should at least know my name. Nick K, Sergeant. Selim Osman, Lieutenant. Hierarchy on me. Shukran, Yahuya. Solid copy, Colonel. I see your flashlight. Keep moving forward. I'm just ahead. Over. Your friends better not do anything dumb. Find cover. Go. Go. My God, you were right. What the hell is that thing? Sergeant K, you all right? Yeah, all good. This was a bad idea from the jump. We should get back to the temple and reinforce it. Then we find a way out of here. I think that's the best plan I heard all day. My name is Lieutenant Colonel Eric King of the United States Air Force. I'm a chief nuclear engineer of the Iraq Survey Group, tasked with locating hidden chemical weapons. Our mission has uncovered something unexpected. I will now begin an autopsy of an unidentified life form. That's the last one. Should at least slow them down. 
Long enough to spot them on the cameras. We should reset that trip wire. Give me a hand. We've been in some fucked up situations before. Never as fucked as that. If I gotta fight these things, there's no one else I would move on my side. You know I always got your back, buddy. Come with me. Something else. You think? I don't know how many places like this we've gone without a second thought. These relics are better off than the dust. What's your problem? These people didn't ask for this war. Why are you defending the enemy, Sergeant? You and me both know they're not all our enemies. Fuck, Jason. It's about the girl at the checkpoint. Shit, Nick. How many times? We thought she had a bomb. It was just a bag of groceries. We fucked up. That girl's death is getting under your skin, buddy. Yes. As a matter of fact, it is. Isn't it getting under yours? Doing actual receiving. Cameras are green and the holes have been demolished. Over. I hear you. Over and out. Approximation, the creature is eight feet tall, bipedal wing. Wing webbing appears to be affixed to its forelimbs and to the digits of its hands. The dermis looks to be smothered in some sort of excretion. Underneath it is diseased almost. The creature is starting to rapidly decompose in death. I see you. Weapon to be standing on the mob. Or they got massacred from behind. These creatures aren't dumb. They're predators. Bet your bottom dollar if they came this way before. They could come again. Closest I've been to hell. Blowing a hole through the rock face, we found a gateway to a strange world below. 
a phosphorescence emanated from beneath, casting its eldritch light over us all. Lady Bradshaw was insistent that we descend further. Perhaps Mary is right, and Bradshaw is becoming reckless and uncontrollable. But I can't stop thinking about what's down there. I am now working with Crow and Pullman to set up a winch and elevator to descend into the shaft. What mysteries lie below, I wonder, undisturbed by the world above. What's that? It says they found something weird down here. Yeah, no shit. Get us out of here. Right now, I couldn't give a crap if it was the crown jewels of England. Perfect. Looks like a good choke point. Any of those freaks coming up from below are sure to pass through here. Set some charges? Yeah. Yeah, rig these pillars for maximum coverage. More likely to see the trip wires, though. You think those things can tell the difference? You shouldn't underestimate them. Mind the sides. We're more likely to catch them out. Smaller spread, but the explosives are better hidden. What do you think? Those things are devious fuckers. You're right. We plant the charges to the side of the hall. All right. They won't see this one coming. talking about this yeah what's left to say you know that checkpoint was a prime target for suicide bombers we had to act in the moment we had to make a call it was the wrong call why is it that no one ever tells us straight everyone just makes up bullshit and get by that's why we're in the sandbox in the first place right i just want the truth jason Shooting that woman messed with my head. Are you seriously gonna tell me it didn't mess with yours, man? We fucked up. If we make it out of here, we'll face up to that. If we die down here, maybe it's what we deserve. You know I was seeing Rachel. Are you serious? In three weeks. It's hard. Drop kick this mailman to an actual. We're at a stairwell leading down into a maze. Please advise over. Found a camera here. Let's head back.
about done yourself this time, puppy dog. The 28th of December. God forgive us. For days we have studied this dead, silent realm and its entombed abominations. Now the horrors have come for my own dear Mary. Crow found her unconscious in the star chamber, her notes scattered around her. He carried her back to our supply room and laid her down in one of the cells. When Bradshaw learned what had happened, she was evasive about Mary's work down there. As I cleaned my wife's face, she spoke to me in a fever, sounding distressed and confused. I have resolved to keep a vigil over her. I pray her fever abates so we can escape this cursed place.
run. Creature has powerful claws and fangs formed from hardened and identifiable tissue. Two of the incisors appear grossly malformed and discolored. Oddly out of place. The membrane surrounding the specimen seems to originate from its mouth. Blood is like nothing I've seen. I'll now perform a UV sweep to further inspect the fluids. Pull check, is that you? signal now. It's worth a shot. A long shot. Oh, we don't even know if there's a working transmitter on the surface. Those wires gotta go somewhere, though. You think they still work? Well, looks to me like they just snagged up. Don't feel much like climbing out there. <laughs> We have to hurry. It's not safe here. that you could fight? Yeah, me either. What was that thing? I don't know. Whatever it is, it's not alone. Where have you been? One of those things got its dirty hands on me, dragged me down here, left me for dead. Fuck. Fuck doesn't even start to cut it. I'm lucky to have gotten away. You're talking to a scientist. There's no such thing as luck. You should be thankful I was there to help you. I'm really grateful. Thank you. Semper Fi. We gotta find a way out of this hole. So, this is where you've been hiding now? 
you have any weapons? Uh, do you mind? Just need some batteries for this damn light. You could just ask. That ever cross your mind? Looks painful. Yeah. It is. Think you can keep still? I'm glad you're here. Yeah. Well, uh, guess I'm a little glad too. All those same symbols in the shepherd's huts. Those people must have been in the valley a long time. <coughs> There's a way up. There's no way we're making it. Look at it. It's barely climbable. We can make it together. How did I know you were gonna say that? I met Eric in climbing glass. I can get us out of here. <laughs> Something funny you wanna share? This place is fucked. We are so fucked, we don't stand a chance. You keep that to yourself. I'm gonna get through this, and if you want to, you better try and keep up. You okay? Yeah, just need a minute. A minute isn't gonna kill us. Until it does. God, you look terrible. Gee, thanks, Rachel. You ever think about going into motivational speaking? Seriously, though, are you okay? That's gotta be about the dumbest question I have ever been asked. <sighs> Give me the silent treatment, huh? What do you want me to say? I don't know. Something to get our minds off this place. Okay. So why did you become a physicist? I mean, you don't... I don't look the type? Well, you doubt. Oh, should I be wearing nerd clothes? That's not what I meant. You just don't strike me as one. Science was the furthest thing from what everybody thought I'd do. Something just for me. I know a little something about that. You do? I'm seeing someone else. You don't seem surprised. Nick, right? That obvious? Huh. Does Eric know? Yeah. Yeah, he does know. I guess I just wanted to let go. It would be someone new. Hey. You do know this story. <coughs> Wait, 
It's okay. I'm here. There's medication up there. It may help you, but we need to move now. <clears throat> over that rope won't hold wait do you really believe those medicines will help me we don't know enough about those things come on Rachel don't bullshit me it doesn't look good Truth is so overrated. But if it happens, if I turn, you have to kill me. If you turn, it won't be you I'm killing. Maybe it's best I don't. What do you mean? Just do it! I'm not gonna make it. Where's the girl that saved me from those things? I know you can do it, Clarice. You just have to have hope. You're screwed enough as it is. If you stay with me, there's no hope for you at all. Sounds like they're having way more fun down there than we are up here. Over. Eyes alive.
here for now. If they hit us, my best hunch is it'll be from the chasm. If? You feeling optimistic, Lieutenant? We're facing an enemy we know zero about. An enemy of unknown size in their home turf. So it's to be us. Radio's our best shot. Mix it up for the cavalry. Mix it up. There is a transmitter up there. It's gonna have a limited range. One thing Eric did manage to get right about this shit, Joe. He gave us air support. Lord loves America. We get that soon allowed, our first maybe push me. That means we have to find a way to reach him, of course. One problem at a time. All their findings never saw the light of day. They just stayed buried in the dust. I'm gonna need a hand to get this up and running. That thing looks like it was sabotaged. How would they do that? We gotta work with what we have. Fall back if anything moves out here. It's safer inside. Good job, Sergeant. Those things will kill you, Sergeant. Yeah, like smoking is the biggest threat to my life right now. Fuck that in my life. It's good. It's nothing. It's just a ghost signal. Even without a transmitter, a radio picks up a faint signal. It's just ghost. So fix that transmitter. If we can establish a signal and contact CENTCOM, then we're one step closer to home. I don't trust any of you pussies to do it. What the fuck, Lazarus? Sit your ass down. Back from the dead, baby. <laughs> Rope of Merwin. It'll be best you stay here and recover. Oh, and that you have all the pun? Oh, fuck that. Let me break this down to you Barney style. I'm the only one here who's a mechanic. That's what you call a no-fucking-brainer. He's got a point.
Dodge and save him with محتاجين الكلاب دول لنخرج من هنا انت اتجننت دول على الديوانه انا ما شفتش الغول في غول هناك هو ده العدو الحقيقي سليم انت اتجننت اسمعني ارجوك اسمعني قتلوا الامريكان كانوا هيقتلونا انا اسمعني أنا شفت غول بعناية دول وقتلت واحد اخرس وامشي ورايا أنت سامعني خالص لا أنت اسمعني دلوقتي يا إما تمشي ورايا يا إما خليك هنا وتعفن اختار الله يلعنك استنى أنا جاي
shot. Where's Eric? Rach? I'm so sorry. You cut me loose and left me for dead. I had to or we'd both be dead. You have to understand that. <clears throat> we good? Tim, isn't it? I understand you're not the brightest, Nick, but even you must know what I'm talking about. You've been fucking him, haven't you? That's the best you got? Stop it! I know it, Tim Rach. I know. You better step off before I start swinging. Colonel or no Colonel? Don't, Nick. I spent a long time waiting for you, Eric. Until? Until I had to move on. Always loyal. Always loyal, huh? You weren't so loyal when you cut the rope. It's good to see you, Rachel. Thought we'd lost you. Who else made it through? It ain't good. Merwin's gone. Those things. They got Joey. Clarice. What is it? Clarice was infected. Those things, I don't know how they got inside her. I couldn't take the risk. I had to leave her behind. You telling me Clarice is still out there? That's not Clarice anymore. I saw her changing before my eyes. I believe it. Same thing happened to Joey. <laughs>
all we need. Is this place mine?
We should keep moving. Hello again. My friend did not help me. Yeah, I can see that. What happened up there? Your friends are a little too jumpy for my liking. It's making me nervous. Lowering your weapon might help alleviate some of the tension. Make a move. I fucking dare you. I feel like our uniforms are getting in the way of what could be a beautiful relationship. Shut up! I say we drill these sorry looking motherfuckers. What do you think, Colonel? Make the call, Colonel. We need their help. They're the enemy, Nikki. I don't trust any one of you. <laughs> Them. We must get this door open. Think about it. Fuck, Jason! The enemy of our enemy is our friend! Move! Come on, man! Damn it! Help them! I'll cover the corridor!
teach you to mess with a Marine. I come in peace. Don't you fucking move. You alone? Anyone else make it? It don't happen too fast. I think it's just you and me. Just you and me, huh? Well, that's just fucking great. I don't mean you any harm. I swear. No shit. I'm the one holding the gun. You looking for trouble? Says the American with the gun. We don't have to be friends. But we can be allies. That's something I can get on board with. For one second, you're trying to cross me. Best believe me. Follow me, second, you're dead. I kill vampires. That looks like our best way through. One of us holds up the gate, the other can slip through. I think there's a way through. I just need to clear it from my side. Do it quick. Those things could be anywhere. You got any idea what we're dealing with? They're vampires. Not possible. My father once told me, if something looks like shit and smells like shit, you don't have to taste it to know that it's shit. <laughs> Believe me, they're vampires. We must work together to defeat them. Yeah, it's beginning to look like that. First thing you're gonna do when we get out of here. Hold my son. p.m. Something unholy has happened. As I sat with my wife, I noticed something in her hand. Lady Bradshaw's brooch. She must have pulled it from her shirt when she grabbed at her. Turning it over, I noticed that it looked like one of the creatures we'd exhumed from the cocoons. 
Were these the demons Mary had spoken about? Had Bradshaw known all along what we'd find down here? Then Mary's corpse moved. It was not my wife. It was something inhuman. It leapt at me, and only the bars of the cell spared me from its fury. Seem like you got your head screwed on. So I gotta ask, what the hell made you sign up with Saddam? For us, we had no choice. What is the meaning of those markings on your hand? to honor the dead. It's the reason I fight. It's as good a reason as any. It's a damn good reason. The only reason. I have no grievance with you. Maybe you need to switch on the news. <laughs> Listen. There was a man once who built his house on the banks of a river. When the floods came, his wall washed away. When the droughts came, the water dried up and the man was thirsty. All day, the insects bit this man's flesh. Yet each night, he says to his wife, we have all the fish we can eat. Your people chose this war, Jason. I think you need to give your mouth some rest. See we get the fuck out of here. to me like a medical bay. This could come in handy. If you want to stick 60-year-old explosive in your bag, be my guest. Those chemical weapons are close, right? Cabinets. Whatever.
whatever's down there, those explorers got there first. Now hold up, will you? How are you doing? You think they're still alive? That's hopeful. Hope is all we got left. Funny how you can know someone for years and never really know them. I have no idea my company was married. That the asshole you were with earlier? You didn't make it. Worse for me. I'm this bad guy to deal with. Time will come when you'll deeply regret this manner. I don't carry regrets. Jack in the box. What do you make of it? It's like nothing I've ever seen. You see that elevator cable? The explorers must have gone down. I don't think they made it back up. That winch still looks functional. No. No? We are not going down there. The archaeologists didn't make it out. What does that tell you? We're not archaeologists? Our world is up there, not down below. Well, there's an army of monsters between us and the world above. They're close. Fire them. Crazy. Those vampires come from anywhere still there. You really want to fight them in their own home? What I've been doing since I set foot in this country. Get that elevator working. Ancient horror has awoken from its slumber and is hungry for blood. Shall we see how many have fallen into shadow? Let's hope nothing unfortunate has befallen Sergeant K. Those taken by the abyss seldom live to tell the tale. As for Jason and Salim, sworn enemies, you cannot seem to bury the hatchet unless that hatchet is buried 
in a bag. I don't want to seem like an ungracious host, but time is against us. I'll be here to greet your charges as they cross the finishing line, or to bury what remains of them under them. Territory. What were you expecting? Cantaloupe caviar. Not exactly honeymoon material, is it? <laughs> I recall a certain somebody saying that she wanted to go ice climbing. Ice climbing is relaxing. What is it? The guy who served me. I, I don't know. He was, he was looking at me pretty strange. Probably doesn't get to see a woman like you around these parts very often, especially when you showered. <laughs> uh, he was saying some weird shit. Such as? It's nothing we should go. No, come on, tell me. He said I'll never again be as happy as I am now. What the hell's that mean? You don't believe him, do you? Of course not. You know, my sole objective, Rach, is to make you happy. Doesn't matter where we are or what we're going through, I'll always put a smile on your face. <laughs> See? I told you. Next time, all you have to do is whistle, and I'll come running to defend your honor. Oh, like my very own loyal puppy dog. Simple five. I'm more than capable of looking out for myself. Now get your feet off my dash, you hillbilly. I thought I lost you. I thought I'd lost you. Right. Eric. Functioning. Colonel, you gotta go! You two Nick, you're coming with us! Come on, Ray!
all clear. That was too close. Bon Marine, follow me. You think that thing's gone? Look like it went down that tunnel. He's alive. Jason's alive. Maybe things aren't going so badly after all. I can't do this anymore. It's time. It's gotta be time. Time for what? You know what? We lay the cards on the table. You can't keep playing this, man. Nick, listen. No, 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 you listen. If I get killed down here, I want to know I stood up like a real man, not some chump. Rachel, you, you said you tell him when the time was right. I need you to tell him now. Tell him the truth. You don't wear a ring because your marriage ended a year ago. He's right. It is time. Roll it out for us. Now? Right fucking now? Yes, now. We may not have another chance. Fine. Eric, you and I, we had something very special. But that was a long time ago. I still love you, Rach. This isn't about choosing. It's about knowing what's best for me. I was on my way. I was making a new life for myself. But life has a way about it. Today, I've seen the same man I fell for all those years ago. I want to try us again. After all that shit he put you through? That's just it. I can't turn my back on my past. If I didn't give you a chance, I'd always regret it. Don't say another word. Pull yourself together. She's made her choice. Let's move on. I understand. Colonel? Ma'am? Let's go find Kolchak. Thank you. Fucked up shit in my life. Nothing comes close to this. They don't seem to be following. Would you like to wait for them, or...? I'll need to be a smart ass. Let's move.
This was all Lady Bradshaw's doing. She knew all along what was down here. She led us to them. I found her below, hunched over the murdered corpse of Van Hoyten. As she turned to face me, I saw that she had changed. My hand fell to the closest weapon I could find, an iron tent peg. I stabbed her with the metal, impaling her in the heart. She died. Unholy screams echoed from deep below, as if answering the sudden release of blood. We are being judged. God is punishing us all for the mistakes we've ever made. Zane is all I have left in this world. After my wife left us, I gave him my all. I wanted him to have everything I didn't. It's a fucking gig. It is. But my boy has made me very proud. He's going to London, to university. If only he would stop stealing. Is your conscience clear, Jason? Green zone. Checkpoint. What checkpoint? Nick and I, we were caught in traffic. Checkpoint had been hit before by suicide bombers. in a bag. Fuck. Tell me. I ordered... I ordered for her to stop, loud and clear, but she didn't. She just kept on walking. I, uh... I had to make a call. Nick... He shot her dead. What was in the bag? Groceries. I don't understand. Why didn't she stop? She didn't hear me. She had fucking headphones on. This. 
this bullshit. I'm not here to honor the dead. Truth is, my life was going nowhere fast. I jumped at the chance to sign up. We all have our reasons. They don't have to be profound. <laughs> profound, huh? Those towers were hit. I was stoned out of my fucking skull. I didn't even hear about it till a week later. How's that for profound? I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing here. You're serving your country. That woman had family, friends. She had her whole life in front of her. And we snuffed it out with a single bullet. I mean, what the fuck? I can hear you thinking. We're waiting for something to happen. Maybe we should take the initiative and make something happen. What do you have in mind? We go inside there and we find a way to hurt them. Those fucking things try to fuck with our heads. They try to kill us. But you and I, we're both standing. Start believing, Salim. We're gonna get out of here and see the sun again. Is that what you truly believe? Hoorah! What on earth is that sound? It's a marine thing. Oh, so does that make me a marine too? Let's not get ahead of ourselves, huh? Okay. Hey, whatever happens out there, I got your back. We'll stand together. It's the only way. God 
didn't make these creatures. No. It's possible we've got this wrong way around. What's that supposed to mean? Touch it. You touch it. Pussy. Goddamn biblical. Shit. Did you see that? I think he's still alive. Oh, that's impossible. In this place, everything's possible. Oh, shit. Fucker's been alive all this time. He's sitting here with half a head. Fluid. Must have preserved his flesh, his brain. What should we do? We can't leave him like this. Well, shit. He's had enough time to get used to it. Are you serious? Oh. Those will attract the vampires. I'll do it.
someone's been aborting the dentist. No thanks. Can you see? The bone is ruptured where they should be, as though smashed from the inside out. What do you say? Maybe these things weren't originally vampires. Maybe they... Nicky, you turned up like the fucking cavalry. I thought you were dead. Not my time. Colonel, you made it. Now, crawling through that tunnel was a highly unpleasant experience. <laughs> Good to see you again, ma'am. Take my hand. Glad you're here, man. This place. What is this place?
need a plan. Fuck those things up and get the fuck out. Good plan. Sergeant K, what do we got left? So we got, um, eight clips of 556 FMJ, three 40 mil high X rounds, a couple of nine mil pistols, four clips between them. We'll make that work. Huh. So that's two Foster rounds. And one block of composition C4. Well, what about the UV lamp? Took a knock, but I can fix it. Just need a minute. All in is not enough. We've also got this. Nah, it's old, unpredictable. We work with what we got. Our fuses are shot, but we can use the C4 to detonate them. Let's just hope they still back a punch. The vampires come from those cocoons. You saw how many there were in that vault? There could be thousands in there. Should we blow them up? Burn as many of those motherfuckers as we can and head for the surface. What do you think, Sergeant? Ooh. I'm not gonna allow him to carry a pistol. We are way past that point now, man. We stand together as one. Looks like our explorer friends were here too. We should search this place before we move out. There. Got it. confident are you that they'll work? They'll work. This thing with you, me, and, uh... Forget it, Nick. I I'm just saying... Don't. Keep your head clear of everything but the task ahead. It's the only way we'll live. Over here. I wouldn't give to see daylight again. Daylight and a cold one. That whole mess with you and Nick. It's out in the open, right? It's for the best. But regardless of everything else, secrets keep you sick. in it for him. Is it really all about these tablets? formed from chords, musical scales, sonics. Mary was a pianist. She deciphered it. She thought these carvings represented the stars. Do you see? It's Zetus, the whale. We're a long way from the night sky. It's a mystery. A 
According to the journal, there was only one scale of sound in the device. But Mary was studying it alone. I think there may be another. I'm going to need your help. What can I do? This console is too big to operate single-handedly. These creatures were once peaceful. Their language was full of music. How could they not feel emotion? Then a tragedy fell upon them. Their great empire collapsed. Their music fell silent, and they turned on each other. What happened? Sickness? Madness? What turned them from architects into killers? Whatever it is, it twisted them. Now they're creatures of hate. Animals. Dead things. With no one left to kill. So they slept. And they waited. They waited for us. Rachel. 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 Rachel, look at me. She has it. It's inside her. Came from the stars. This isn't their home. It's an ark. Do something! Stirring into one of them! Please, Rachel, you have to hold on! It's killing me! I'll put her out of her misery. Hold her the fuck down. We can still save her. There's got to be a way. We can't lose her. There's no other way. Hold her down. Help me. I'm trying. Fuck, Rachel. I have to put you down. Good. 
<laughs> Let be done. Stand up, Sergeant K. Those things aren't dumb. You'll have heard the gunshot. You need to move the fuck out. You too, Colonel. We gotta go. Goodbye, Rich. I'll always love you. I'm seeing those mounds are made of cocoons, thousands of them. If we set the charges there, all burn. Move quick. Okay, listen up. We've been hit hard tonight. We lost brothers. And we lost Rachel. But now it's time to get some payback. We plant charges on as many of those clusters as possible and then detonate them remotely. The second those charges go up, we all last to the exit. Luck's on our side. Do more than fry a few vampires. Create a diversion. Shalim, you ready? I am. Okay then. Let's get loose, kids. Hey. Who's going to place the dynamite? Alright, fuck it. I'll do it. You're crazy. We'll do it together. Nah, the more of us down there, the more chances we'll get seen. Take the detonator. If I don't make it, Nick, hear me out. If I don't make it, I want you to blow those charges. Just don't go getting trigger happy on me. Every step of the way, you keep in radio contact. And if there's no radio signal, then I'll pop the flare. You see it go up, you hit that detonator. Be quick, be safe. ahead of you. You gotta move fast.
that, man. It's the mother of all. Hundreds of them. At least you've got the boss to tell me the truth. I'm sorry, Nikki. For this. For what happened at that checkpoint.
Can't you keep up? Eyes forward at all times. Sergeant K, are you with me? My shit can go down in 24 hours. Nick, I need you here. Dead man. We need to go. You can't make it out of here without your help. You can't leave me alone. That man is not one of us. You're wrong. Salim is one of us now. Marines don't leave their own behind. Fear Miss Salim.
fucking believable. Those things were all over us. Here's Celine, plus a few of them like a splash down of the goddamn Super Bowl. <laughs> Listen up. I'm not out of the woods yet. But I see in front of me, you're the best. Fuck that. Best of the best. You will get home. What is it? Should have brought her here. Fucking alive. Drop check to Coyote 2. Radio check. Over. We got back up again. Repeat the enemy. Look. Look around you. So quiet. 
You think those shepherds are still around here? I can use a cold one. I must return home to my boy. He must be worried about me. Oh, you got to be kidding me.
mailman to an actual. We have eyes on and a clear breeze. some of your charges to the light, while others have fallen to the dark. Survival often comes at a great cost, a cost that others sometimes must pay. I look forward to our next encounter. Perhaps I'll choose a story that's a little more homely next time, somewhere you'll be guaranteed of a decent night's sleep. Rest assured, wherever it is, you'll find it extremely hard to leave. Until the next time. You know the way out. I just got off the red eye. What's your excuse? Good flight? Oh, shit movie, shit meal, no leg room. They cram you in the back? By the toilets. Nice. Coffee wasn't so bad, though. Good fucking muffins. Did you read the brief? On the flight. How's it going with the analysis team? The ISG team took heavy losses, but it wasn't a complete disaster. We just had to scrape some of them off the floor. Poor bastards. And the entities? Like nothing we've seen before. Cool check, Jason. First Lieutenant, Marine Force Recon. The best of the best, huh? Or so they advertised. Fuck! Now how many times do I have to keep telling you the same damn story? I understand. However, SETCOM needs to iron out any irregularities. Such as? The whole fucking thing was irregular! Such as why you allied with an enemy combatant? You weren't fucking there! Those things were ripping us to shreds. I don't give a damn who it was. We needed all the help we could get. I stepped back into that hell to save Selim. And that man was worth five of you people. Semper fucking five! And Sergeant K? Nikki didn't make it. So they cooperated with an Iraqi soldier down there? Republican Guard, if you can believe it. Must have made a hell of an impression for Kolchak to go back for him. I'm dying to meet this guy. I am not answering any more questions until I see my son. That's not how we do things around here. You don't have a clue. Jason came back for me. What does that tell you? Down there, this damn war of yours was over. I'd like to talk more about the entities. The vampires. I'm finding it very hard to believe that you killed those things with that. 
Untie me, and I'll show you how I did it. The analysis team are still pulling specimens from the site. It's carnage down there. They used dynamite? We don't know how they got their hands on it. Ah, shame. This testimony could have been valuable. This is like Winterfold all over again. Uh-huh. Ah, and here we have Colonel Eric King, our in-house genius. He definitely got more than he bargained for. Everything you know about biology just went up in smoke. These things, they're advanced. They're stronger than us, more intelligent than us. If you want to get ahead of this, you need to start taking me seriously. None of us doubt the severity of the situation, Colonel. After all, most of your team didn't make it back alive. And I'll have to live with that. Let's move on to Caleb. She was infected. Her comrades had no choice but to... Parasite? Extracted. You read her profile. Yeah. She could have gone far. If this hadn't happened... We still on for next Sunday? Janet's making hot pot. You bet your ass we're on. I'll never get used to this town. Why would you want to? At least this one was localized. A small blessing. So, what do you make of it all? Doesn't matter what I think. Only thing that matters is controlling the flow of information. As far as the world knows, not a damn thing happened here. You want to know what it means to be a killer? Think of the most profound thing you've ever done. The most beautiful thing you've ever created. And I promise you, it's nothing compared to watching the life bleed out of someone. To see the fear in their eyes. To feel them pawing at you for release. To hear them pleading, begging. That's true art. That's what you have to be, an artist. I've left my mark on the world. Have you?